yes uh, or no. So I want to know, would you put in writing that you will develop a diversity plan for me that includes pipeline and what you will ask your board and what will you do at the C-suites? Mr. Corbett, yes or no? We already have that plan in place. So, no, I, I need it. So the question is, will you put it in writing to me as the chairwoman, yes or no? Yes. Absolutely, and we're devoted to get yes. it done right. Yes, we have. It's ours as publicly disclosed. Now, I want it sent to me. Let's be real clear. I want it in writing addressed to me. Yes or no? Yes. 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 Okay. So now the question is, we look at the sum five to seven trillion dollars. So for me, business diversity. Who are you using with your assets, your international funds? So I want to know, yes or no, do you have an African-American, a minority, or female company that manages your assets? Yes or no? It's a yes or no? We're not in the asset management business. Or any of your, fine, your bank funds, your pension, your members' funds, your money? Uh, I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure the answer is yes. Yes, we have minority-owned firms that manage money. Uh, yes, we think we do. Yes, we do. I believe yes. Yes, we have minority managed firms that own money, manage money. The next thing, my colleague asked you about the Rooney Rule. Dan Rooney started that in 2003, 4 because he was the diversity committee chair, and African Americans were bringing all the monies in, and they didn't have any black coaches or black owners. So I knew by your facial, most of you didn't know what that was. So let me tell you something you will remember. The Beatty Rule, and I'm doing it with the federal banks and it's House Bill 281. I suggest you read it and you have your staff and your lobbyists read it. Last question. I think I'm gonna ask you, would you participate if I create, we do the same thing for government. We have OMWI, so I'm gonna have BOMWI, Banks Office of Minority Women and Inclusion. In your positions as CEO, will you hire a director of diversity that reports to you? Yes or no? My director does. Uh, lady went it's to HR. a yes or no for my time. I'm sorry. Uh, yes, kind of. Uh, reports to our head of HR. No, this is a, no. I want the title to be director of the Office of Minority and Inclusion in Banks. So if you have somebody, you change the title or you hire somebody. Will you do it? Yes or no? We can look at changing the title. If that's oh, the, thank you. you already have Let's to. start, Mr. Solomon. Let's go this way. We can look at changing changing the title and the role and consider it. Glad to do the same. Will you authorize this person to then have a meeting with me so I can do a follow-up that we can be more than aspirational? I'm happy to. Yes. And let me just say, three of you were smart enough to at least meet with me before I was chairman and then came back. While none of you are where you should be, I do want to say thank you for being aspirational. Mr. Solomon, I want to thank you for coming in and at least having people in the pipeline. Mr. Korbach, I want to thank you for coming in and telling the truth about what you had and hiring people. And Mr. Diamond, I want to thank you for also coming in and doing a program that included me.